Oh, I think it started. This was a very, uh, this is just a very sporadic stream. This was random. I woke up like 20 minutes ago. I was like, I want a live stream because I have a bunch of boxes. I'm about to shoot some videos. I want to knock one out on a live stream. I might do another live stream tonight at the end of the day. So, uh, I think there's only like four or five of you here. Uh, Kyle, Kyle, you're here. Awesome. A late night fun. Yeah. Basically the only people here are the ones that aren't out partying, have no lives. You stay at home, people like Kyle. No friends to party with. No, I'm just playing. Uh, guys, just uh, one of these. One of these are the, I think these are all November, except this one is like a quarterly box, the curiosity box. But um, go ahead. What do you guys want to see unboxed here? And then I'm going to open up some Funko Pops later. I'm probably going to do a giveaway too, because I have a lot of giveaway stuff and I want to do giveaways for you guys. Uh, Rosa, what's up? Kyle, what's up? Epic. NT, what's up? Christopher from Japan. Finally, we're on a good time. We're not up at 3 a.m. in the morning unboxing things. Uh, Funknatic, what's up, man, from Singapore? Cyberwolf! Cyber, dude, you're not out at the club? I have lived <laughs> and I got a house. We'll be making music when my stuff gets here. Awesome. And then I give you shout outs, and everyone keeps asking about Cyberwolf to come back. Loot Gaming! Loot gaming. Ming, 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 ming. I don't know if you remember the Echo voice. Cyber Wolf. Solid is the best mission. Oh man, dude, I've been so I've been so busy here. I've I think my uh my subscriber count has been like ooh, up and down for like the past two or three weeks because I just haven't been putting out a uh, content for you guys. I've been I've been studying for this uh this test that if I didn't take, I wasn't gonna be in the military anymore because they're like kicking people out for it. Uh, so I've been a little busy. Everyone vote for a box before we start talking and I go ranting off. Everyone vote for a box. Either the Curiosity Crate, Loot Gaming, Comic Block, or Shirt Block. Right. Shirt Block down there. You can't see it. My hands are in the way. Everyone vote for a box. Trinidad Lara, I'm Camilla. I'm Camilla? But your name is Lara? Trinidad Lara? Okay. Hey, Camilla or Laura. Uh, glad I finally made it. Anthony Bassler, what's up, man? Pop AR, cool. Okay, I didn't think there's going to be, I thought there's going to be like two people in here, for real. I thought it was going to be me and Christopher and Kyle just hanging out. Um, I'm surprised you guys made it without late notice. Uh, Ethan, Christmas, I've missed all of your live streams from like the past month. Well, I'm glad you made it to this one, man. Maybe you'll win something from this one. Jam, what's up? Joshua Nida or Nita. Hi from Texas. Shout out to Texas. Comic Block. Curious Curiosity. I can't even say my own box name. Curiosity. Loot Gaming. Curiosity. I'm seeing a lot of curiosities. I'm seeing a lot of curious people for this curiosity box. My name is Camilla Trinidad. Okay. Okay. What's up, Camilla? Where are you from? Uh yeah, you what? Yeah, you paying 150 for the band box, Stan Lee box? 150? Oh, they were supposed to release that what yesterday? I was supposed to follow them. I think I think the police are here for me. I get notifications when you go live. Awesome. Alright, so I think the curiosity box, and I'm I was gonna shoot a video for this, but you guys picked it. You guys picked it. It was gonna be like Bam, new video, curiosity box. But if you guys want to see it, um, this is from the Vsauce group. They're on YouTube and they they're like into like scientific um technology stuff. It's, it's a lot of scientific stuff, I think. But um I had a, a box from it was from Geekfield, but it was like catered by them. And it had a lot of like just science stuff in it. This is a quarterly box, I think. So you get three a year. It feels like there's something very heavy in there. Um, I'll have I'll put all the pricing and stuff down in the uh, description after. I didn't want to put it right now because I don't know what box you guys were gonna choose. So curiosity box. Did I cut all the tape? Sweet. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, maybe what you're gonna see when you open this up. What the heck? Okay, okay. I'm just gonna take this spoiler book off. But. Oh god. You're gonna see nothing at all because it's big like wrapping paper on top. Alright. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. 
who's who's shouting stuff out sweet all right you guys are watching good pay attention class is in session all right so we got uh some gift wrapping paper this actually looks pretty cool though looks like a squid is that there i wonder if that's there that's the curiosity box logo looks like a squid on there um and you get you get blue purple and green so that's really cool um just because it is the holiday so now i have gift wrapping paper um i don't know if they're like in sheets or not are, they, are these in sheets maybe they're in sheets what okay that's just the top so oh okay it's kind of in sections it's kind of weird though then you're gonna have like creases all over your box but whatever unless you got small boxes but all right gift wrapping paper that's not too cool but it is kind of cool because uh you it's the holidays so it's kind of perfect timing or an alien cure it it might be an alien i don't know nah dude it look it straight up looks like an octopus or maybe it's an alien octopus Cyberwolf might be honest. Dude, there's a lot of stuff. Okay, so once you take that off, there is quite a bit of stuff in here. There's a lot of stuff. Um, all right, we got a uh, UV sauce. What the heck? Here you go. Uh, UV sauce 372 nanometer electromagnetic wavelength generator. What the? What the hell, Bobby? What is this? Shine this lamp on your teeth, your nails, paper, money, the box you're recently reading, or anything you want. You'll notice that certain items will glow. It's because they contain phosphors, which absorb the energy UV radiation we can't see from the lamp and re-emits it as visible light. What once was hidden in the invisible to the human eye ultraviolet light range is now revealed. Cool. Um, what? Isn't this just like an ultraviolet light, like a black light? Just a handheld black light? Let's see. Okay. It's got a little uh, tassel so you can put on things. Okay. What the heck? All right. It's just a straight up light. It's got torch and tube. Oh, man. So right there it says torch and tube. So I'm guessing that's for this would be the torch light. And this is the tube because there's a lamp right there. Um, where's the battery? I want to use this. Maybe I guess you got to supply batteries for it. Oh man, I think it uses four double A's in there, but um, pretty cool. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what all you're gonna do with that. It doesn't really. It could fit in your pocket. It's not too big. I don't know if you want to put that in your pocket though. But maybe there's batteries in here to help me. I don't know. But uh, a UV 372 nanometer electromagnetic wavelength generator. What do you guys think about that? Is that super cool? I don't know. It's kind of cool. But I can't use it right now. And, and I have a lot of lighting in here. So I probably wouldn't be able to see much anyway. The yellow box. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Let me catch up on this. Yeah, autograph box. Oh, is Stan Lee the uh, the guy in the band box? Okay, we gotta talk about this box though. But answer that, Kyle. Stan Lee, <laughs> the guy in the box. Uh, but luckily YouTube fixed it. Nice comment block. Noob, we already opened this, so no. <laughs> or an alien. Okay, you guys haven't typed much. Good. I mean, the alien from Independence Day looks like a. It did. That is true. This this might be an alien. Okay, you're right, Rosa. You added you added some some facts, some backup information for uh, Cyberwolf's theory. That is what they use to find blood. True, you can use that. Battery's not included. <laughs> no, they weren't. They might be in here somewhere. Looks like a pop squid. You need to turn off the lights for you. Yeah, I can't do that. There's too much lighting in here right now, and it's daytime. Like I'm using like daylight from outside my window here right now uh it's neat but not too much use for it haha -ha. i mean yeah i don't i don't know what all you could use this for i've only used it for like like random curious things like oh there's 
this glowing stuff on Cyberwolf's uh, computer chair. What is this? This is weird. Why is Cyberwolf's computer chair glowing so brightly in this UV light? It's crazy. Moving on. Next, we have a magnetic iron filing interval keeper. Yeah, okay, what? They're giving us some really good stuff in here. Or right, some just really curious stuff. Hence the name, Curiosity Box. Magnetic Iron Filing Interval Keeper. You know what? That's just That sounds like a very uh, complicated name for a very simple thing. I bet this, what is it? It's going to be like a paperweight or something. Come out. Oh, oh, Jesus. Get out of here. Oh. Okay. Sweet. What? Okay. Oh. The thing I didn't slam this out, it's glass. Uh, yo, this is just a... <laughs> I can't believe they named it that. It's just a, a hourglass, but... Oh, that is super cool. Okay, I don't want to put this too close. Dude, that is cool. Okay, so it's like an hourglass, but look at it spike up. There's a magnet down here at the base, right here. And this is like, this is that, um I think, iron-filled sand it's like it has a lot of iron in it well my face looks super i look like an alien right now that's pretty cool wow look how small my face looks in there but look at the sand pile up in there Let's see if it shows that there you go see how it piles up because of the magnet on the bottom if it doesn't have that base if it's not all about that base about that base and only treble it doesn't spike up right there pretty cool pretty cool i i actually like that it's pretty cool i think it's probably one minute too um yeah i should have did i should have did a video for this one this stuff is awesome uh different sculpture every time oh, okay oh a different sculpture every time magnetic iron filing interval keeper that's pretty cool okay so I'm impressed already by this box. This is some cool stuff. I like nerdy stuff like this. I like geek stuff like this. That's pretty cool. I want to put this over here. I hope I don't knock that off after unboxing everything. What did you guys think of that? That was actually that was actually pretty cool. Um, boop, boop, boop. Let's see. It's neat, but not too much. Okay. Are you going to get the new Bugs Life Pops? I know I am. Uh, negative. I'm not that big of a Bugs Life fan to get it. And plus, I don't have I don't have room right now, so I'm only collecting exclusive pops that I really want right now. Uh, and I remember that, Kyle. Dude, once I move into a, a new house, which I probably will soon, very shortly, hopefully, um, I'll be I'll collect more. Are you getting the new Power Rangers Action Pose? Ooh, probably. I would get some Power Ranger Action Pose. Too much alone time. A cyber. Everyone needs alone time. It's a magnet. Yes, like. All 14 of us do, are doing tonight alone. You guys aren't alone. You have each other now. See, I brought us all together in my fortress of solitude. You see what I did there? Solitude. What's the matter? So I've been pushing too many papers. <laughs> nice. All right. So uh, it's all about the pace. Can't really tell time because the magnet speeds it through. No, it doesn't. What are you talking about? Rosa? No. No, 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 Rosa. I don't think. No. The magnet is so far down that. It's going to go the same amount of time. It just piles it up right there. Unless you were just joking with me, Rosa. Are you trolling me, Rosa? All right. Next, uh, this cool thing. What is it? The original. Ooh. All right. What is this? This is the key to Pandora's box. I'm pretty sure this is like one of those uh, um, old school like tools. Is this like a sextant? Cause I've never, I don't think I've ever seen one of those. Is this to navigate the ocean back in the 1700s? Nope, this it's a spin top toy. Never mind, I'm completely wrong. Now, what is this? Original uh, gyroscope. Okay, produced since 1917, the Tedco gyroscope has been a class of, a classic educational toy. Uh oh, okay. Did anyone guess that? Was anyone like, it's a gyroscope? What nerd in here said that? Yo, what does it... 
How does it balance? This thing doesn't even stand up. How do you stand this up? This is a lie. This gyroscope does not balance. What is going on here? What is going on here? I can't get it to balance. Apparently, it's supposed to stand up on here, on this little stand. And spin forever? I don't even know. It's going to fall. There's a rope in here, too, though. There's like a rope. So you get a gyroscope. It shows it it shows it standing right here though. So I don't know. I don't want to mess with that for like 15 minutes to try to get that stand though. It wasn't it wasn't standing for me. And then you got some rope here. Maybe. Too much stuff. All right, next item. That was a gyroscope. I'll figure out what it does later. Um, I won't take too long with that. What is this? I think we got a poster. What? Okay, you got a, whoa, it says ultraviolet poster printed with UV ink, I and Q. Okay, someone can't spell. Black light reactive. Uncover four creatures that glow in real life under UV sauce light <laughs> what? all right so that's pretty cool so they gave you something they gave you a poster to actually use with uh the black light that they gave you okay these animals glow under uv is what it says on top and of course you can't see anything because you need the black light for them to glow oh uh, i'll try to get some batteries before the end of the stream and and put it in there. I think I have some. We'll see. And I'll, I'll try to show it to you guys. But all right, Adam Williamson, what's up? Are you going? Are you going to bed? Okay, okay, Adam. Have a good night. Thanks for stopping by, though, Adam. I hope you're having a good day, man, or a good weekend. Uh, that's cool. Filling or filing? It said filing, didn't it? Iron filing. Yeah, dude. Cyberwolf trying to call out my reading skills over here. Iron filing. I can read. I can read Cyberwolf. Cue the mid. <laughs> Night, Adam. A top gyro top. Okay. A spinner. You guys here. Oh. So you just spin it. Okay. I don't know what the stand was for then. I couldn't get it to stand. It looked like it was standing by itself. The key to ultimate power. Spin it. Um, I mean, is it gonna spin? oh Jesus, yo, this thing is like metal too. This is like heavy metal. Is this the right way? Oh no, I think you do it this way. Ooh, okay, it spins. Okay, I can't. It's not that impressive, actually. It keeps falling down. I think I need to be on some concrete, and I need to use a string to, like, and whip it. It would just fall off my desk. I have, like, seven inches of space right here. Um, Do you plan on getting Mr. Hanky the Crystal Poo when the pop comes out? Uh, Possibly Mr. Hanky. I, I like Mr. Hanky. I like South Park. Those are coming out as uh pops? I didn't even know that. You overthink and complicate the item LO key to Pandora's box. You're supposed to think with this box, Autumn. What do you you can't just you can't just go off what the boxes say. You have to think, you know. There's this box holds many mysteries, Autumn. And I'm glad you made it here, by the way. And Rachel Mace. And Daydreams and Nightmares. Holy crap, some more people pouring in. Uh Florida's Bluest Angels. Or Angel. <laughs> Angels. How was, how'd your exam go, Timberly? Was it good? LOL, where's the humanity? How about a quick flex? Uh, I am flexing right now, Smallville. I stay flexing. Just so you know, if you didn't know that, I'm always flexing all the time. I don't stop. <laughs> where do you where do you live? Just curious because in Maryland, it's 1025 at night. Just wonder. I'm in uh, Okinawa, Japan right now. So a little island off of mainland to the south of the mainland. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, guys. Uh, moving on later. Quest. 
Uh, Letter Quest Remastered. Okay, The Power of Words. Oh, it's a downloadable game. I'm probably not going to play that. Does anyone want this? Does anyone want that? There's the code. Screen capture it. Use your phone. Take your phone out. You got three seconds. Three, two, one. Or, you know, you could just, you know, watch this after. You can watch it after. Letter Quest Remastered The Power of Words. Um, and it's on Steam. And you can use it on Windows or Mac. So, cool. You get a, a free game. Um, you have a book here. Packing for Mars. Mary Roach. Mary Roach, author of Stiff. Sounds like uh, some adult reading. Author of Stiff, New York Times bestseller. Packing for Mars, the curious science of life in the void. Um, let's see. Um, the best-selling author of Stiff and Bonk Explores. <laughs> what? The irresistibly strange universe of space travel and life without gravity from the space shuttle training toilet to a crash test of NASA's new space capsule. Mary Roach takes us on a surreal... What? Surreally? That's a weird word. It's a real entertaining trip into the science of life in space and space on Earth. Okay. Cool. Cool. Right there. You get a book. It's pretty thick. It says New York Times bestseller. You know, I always see like hundreds of New York Times bestseller. How many like New York Times bestsellers are there every year? Is there like a bestseller every week? So there's like 52 bestsellers for the year from New York. That's what it seems like. Oh, and you got a t-shirt. Uh, exclusive t-shirt. See what we got in here. Came in a box, too. That was really nice. This, everything was really, like, packaged very well. Uh, let's see. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? What is going... Oh, what is that? That's like a... It looks like Iron Giant. That straight up looks like Iron Giant, except it has, um, I think, Japanese... Uh, like, a Japanese banner on its shoulders... Yo, it actually, oh, and it's got, like, Japanese on the sides here. Is this an anime, though? Cyberwolf, I need your, your anime expertise. Is this an anime? Does anyone know? But right there, that actually looks really cool. Here, I'll put this on for you guys. I don't, I don't have any spells right now. I don't have my wand, so I can't do any magic. Uh, I have to just walk off camera for a second. Boom. Magic. And we're done. Right there. It actually looks really cool. It feels really soft, too. So, very nice. I like it. That's actually a very nice design, too. I really like this design. And it's like a nighttime shot, so you don't need too much color, but you have just enough. It's like, oh, man. It's very artistic. You have, like, a glow. Like, you have a bonfire in the background going on behind this hill. And it's like illuminating the clouds and everything behind this iron giant. That's pretty cool. Did anyone know what that was? Um, yes, the face. Okay, okay, okay. Hanky Cartman and Piggy. I'm gonna have to check that out. Um, while wow, it's relating, you love <laughs> what reef? What reefer? What are we talking about in here? Um, Camilla. I may have failed, <laughs> but he's going to boost our grade up a letter average and our assignments are worth more. Okay, so that's cool. So maybe you didn't. Hopefully you didn't. You need to stop watching my videos and study more if you're failing. Stop stop spending hours <laughs> doing your amazing artwork. Unless that's like part of your class projects, then keep doing that. Yeah. I'm sure you did fine. <laughs> it's early. It's really early in America. Haha. <laughs> uh wait, what? It's really early in America? No, it's like that's why I did the stream right now because it's like late at night. Everyone's either getting home from, you know, their movies or whatever they're doing, or you know, they're settled, they're settled in. 
I I would think, unless you're just a club person. I don't think I have many people that go to the club. I know uh, Cyberwolf stays at home and has a cup of tea or hot chocolate and uh, watches Golden Girls on Saturday nights. So I figured at least he would be here if I did a live stream. Iron Giant is a favorite movie. Uh, sorry, it must be an anime. No, only like 10 o'clock. Did you get any of the 12 days of Funko items? I got the Flocked Animal and Christmas Freddy. I did not. I did not. I've taken a break from Funko Pops, even though everything behind these Funko Pops, I'm going to be, I'm going to be mixing it up. I'm only going to have my super exclusives back there. I'm, I'm drowning in Funko Pops. I'm getting kind of, kind of tired of all the exclusives. They've been it's just exclusives everywhere. They're not exclusive anymore because they're all exclusive. So uh, very nice shirt. How does it feel? Uh it's 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 pretty soft. It's not like uh loot crate soft. Um has like that dry, not dry feel, they're all dry, but it doesn't have like that soft, um fluffy cottony, you know, like like it almost has a little bit of uh silk or some some soft silk, you know. It just feels like a regular a uh, t-shirt but slightly softer and thinner it's not a real thick shirt so it feels good i like it um he watches going girls must explain the stains on his chair yes christopher let's gang up on cyber wolf golden girls also how many pops do you have i have like 200 something but i'm doing giveaways for him so um uh, all right and then you have um ultra products that are ultra violet Okay, UV edition. So this was the UV edition right here. There's the front. Talks a little bit about it, about the box. How long have we been streaming for, guys? How long is this? Hopefully not too long. Does it say? Oh, wait, no. 26 minutes. Okay, not, not incredibly bad. Not incredibly long. So this is everything you get on the back. Um, is there anything that needs to be elaborated on? Collectible box art, magnetic iron filing interval, the iron samurai. Oh, robot glows in the dark. Nice. So this robot right here glows in the dark. So it also goes along with the UV um, theme that this box is. And night gyroscope. Feel the surprising effects of angular momentum right in the palm of your hands. This classic metal gyroscope is spin credible. And yeah, this this thing is the original gyroscope back from the what was it? Oh, just <laughs> right from uh the 1920s, I think it said. So uh, probably, you know, made from the It looks like it's like it's definitely beat up a lot. Like they uh had to weld this thing yeah there's even weld marks on it so i that might be like an original this might be someone said antique earlier hold up like if you look closely you can see let's see if it clears up it's not clearing up it's not gonna clear up there's like weld marks and stuff and there's scratches but i mean it's it's in really good working condition there's just scratches and stuff on it so they might have like re uh, remodeled it, refurbished it, remodeled, refurbished it. Um, yeah, that was it. Let me look up how much this box actually uh, cost. I forgot the cost of this box. What did you guys think though? That was a lot of stuff. That was some really cool stuff. Like, let's see how much this thing was. Curiosity. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, but what did you guys think of the box and uh, what would be your favorite item from it? I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, curiosity. The curiosity box. Boom. Um, $57. That says my initial payment, though. So I don't know if that's actually uh, what I paid for one box. It might be fifty-seven dollars though. Let me find the site for you guys. Maybe I should have had this information handy. Uh, in the meantime, we'll do a giveaway though. But what would be a good someone come up with a way to do a giveaway? 
real quick. Uh, love Harry Potter. Oh, what? Yeah, I love Harry Potter. That was a question. I didn't see your question mark. Uh, Camilla, yeah, I do love Harry Potter. Harry Potter is awesome. Uh, I'm starting to, what, not as many pops either because Barnes & Noble raised their price from 8 bucks to 10 bucks. Yeah, that's another thing. Like, Funko Pops are, they get expensive, especially if, if you're one of those, like, completionists that like to collect all the Funko Pops, then, yeah, it gets, it gets pretty, pretty dang expensive to collect all of those. Um, and a lot of people just end up selling them. I'm probably going to be one of those people that ends up selling uh, a bunch of my non-exclusive ones and just keep the exclusive ones that I like. Uh, I wish I had as many pops as you do. I have five. Want more, but my mom doesn't understand the passion. <laughs> She's she probably understands the passion and just doesn't want to give in to that passion because she knows that's an expensive passion. So I don't blame your mom for for not wanting to give in to that. Uh, does the restaurant play the theme song over and over? Ha <laughs> ha. Wait, what? Okay, I missed. I missed whatever question was before that. Uh, what's your favorite Christmas movie? My two are the Grinch with Jim Carrey and a Christmas story. Mm, Christmas story is kind of played out for me. Uh, does Gremlins count? Because that's during Christmas. I like Gremlins a lot. And um, what is another good Christmas story? I like the Grinch. I think I think the Grinch would be good. So the Grinch and Gremlins. Even though Gremlins isn't really a nice jolly christmas story it's funny i like it call it classic uh favorite item spin the center oh spin the center yeah it spins Boop. oh god i don't even know if you can see that i don't even know if my my quality is good enough for you to see that spin but yeah pretty nice I'll probably take it outside and play with it, but yeah. Um, the box really is something I would get to be 58 bucks. Ouch. Yeah, let me make sure it definitely was 58 bucks. Let's see. Where is this at? Curiosity. 58 bucks, but really cool stuff. It came with a lot of stuff. Not going to lie. Here we go. Is this the summer? No, this isn't the summer 2016 box. It said, yeah, it says $49.90 plus $8 shipping. So, yeah, basically like uh, $57, $58. You're right. Um, you do save money if you get the uh, longer subscriptions, like two boxes or three. But, I mean, it's also a it's a quarterly box. You get this every three months, I believe. It's not, every, it's not a bi-monthly. It's a quarterly. So... It's only three boxes a year, and I mean, it's it's all most of it. I think is uh, exclusive to this box. So if you're really into that stuff, like I'm really into this stuff, so I would I would most likely get this box. So I thought it was pretty cool, honestly. Daniel, <laughs> Daniel Harp. Hold on, let me catch up on this. I uh, like the hourglass. Uh, the hourglass was cool. If you guys missed, it. look at it, the stand even sticks to it. But um, the hourglass was cool. Check it out. It's just sand, right? Isn't it? It's just sand. And then you put the magnet base in. Boom! It's not just sand. It's magnetic sand that makes crazy sculptures as it drops. And it makes your face look weird when you're live streaming and you talk through it. All right, cool. That was weird. Um, yeah, so that that was actually pretty cool. I don't have I don't have batteries readily available. I, I doubt I have four double A's, but this would have made uh, the shirt glow. Well, won't make the shirt glow. It might glow. This this is just a glow in the dark shirt. But uh, we also got the poster that had like four crazy animals that actually glow in the dark on it, and it reacts to UV light. So. That was, I thought it was a pretty cool box. Um, was it worth $58 though? Like really quick, uh, like this book is probably, um, it says $15 on the back. I bet you can get on Amazon for like 10, maybe eight. We'll say like, we'll say like $8 for that. Uh, then you have your game. 
We'll just give that $2. Downloadable game. So that's $10. Your shirt, I'm going to give this $15 because I really like the shirt. So $10, $15. That's uh, $25. Um, you got the gyroscope. So we're at $25. I give this $5. That's $30. Um, this was really cool. I would probably pay like $8, honestly, for that. That's actually really cool. Cool to sit in your office. Uh, what were we at? We're at thirty, so eight thirty-eight dollars. Um, the poster, we give that, we give that four dollars. It's a cool poster. Well, I haven't seen what's on it, but it's actually really long. Oh, I can actually see what's on it. What the heck? That's pretty cool. So we're at forty-two dollars, and then the UV light. It's got this and the torch. I'd say you'd probably spend like ten dollars, if not more on that and we're at 44 so that's 54 um whoa did i not whoa i didn't even take this out what how did i did i not take this out i missed this yo lotion based simulated germs glows under ultraviolet light for training of uh aseptic techniques Hand washing, gloving, gowning, masking, isolation, surface cleaning. Squeeze a dime size amounts of simulated germs on palms of hands and rub together. Include back of hands. Scrape fingernails on palms to infect germs under nails. Okay, place hands under UV light to view germs. Follow with normal hand wash. Is it what? It says non-toxic glow germs. Lotion-based simulated germs. Okay. And it glows under UV light, so it's simulated germs. That's actually pretty cool. How did I miss that? So, uh, all right. Anyway, with my calculations, we definitely got uh, around sixty dollars, if not more. Uh, oh, and we had the uh, the wrapping paper too. And I, I'd give that wrapping paper like seven. So I think I got uh, close to seventy dollars in the end for everything in the box. And you pay uh, fifty-seven, but um, a lot of this is exclusive too. So. I say you, you at least got your money's worth, but is it worth spending that much on the box? Uh, cool box shirt was really, really cool. I vote Cyber wins the giveaway because why not? <laughs> maybe, maybe he might win. Uh, what did you guys want to do for the giveaway? You can do the quick number game where you guess the number. Miss you, bud. Seems like good quality stuff. Oh, thanks, Kyle. I think I like the supply pod from Outer Space Box. You get more. The new Wizarding World Box should do a replica of Slughorn's Hourglass from Harry Potter. Oh, that would be cool. Autumn Graham, you need to submit your idea. You need to do the the Twitter thing where you tweet me and the company and let them know. A lot of times they listen because I don't think a lot of people tweet at them. I don't. And every time I tweet at them, they like respond with something. So that would be really cool. I did submit to them for the giveaway. Randomly pick a pop on the shelves behind you. Whoever gets it first wins. Mm, okay, okay. Depends on how well the UV light works. That's the deli point for me. True. Five dollars for <laughs> minus five for their spelling. I don't know. Wait, wait. Which one? Which one did they misspell? They misspelled something. I forgot what word they meant. Das shirt is wunderbar. Okay. Is that Gunther? Is Daniel Harp Gunther? What is going on here? Why did you say, why are you speaking German like that, Daniel Harp? Hello, packing for Mars is 480 on Barnes and Noble. Oh, okay. So knock off uh, $5 because I gave that what, like eight or 10? So like three. Okay. So like $65 because you can get that um that book for like five bucks. Poster is 10. <laughs> Hello, Kyle. Solid missed one. Yeah, I did. I did. That's so sad. I don't know how I missed that either. Like, why? Why did I do that? Okay. My night is made. Gonna go crack a beer in thy honor. Nice, dude. Are you gonna get on some siege too, Kyle? What are you what are you doing? Are you still building that computer? Teaches people to wash their hands. Huh? Shows you how dirty your hands can be. Similarly, germs of all right, so we'll go with Christopher Weathrow's um, suggestion of a giveaway. For giveaway, we have to guess your fave Christmas song. No, there's not that many Christmas songs. And I think everyone's Christmas song is that one by Mariah Carey. So that would be easy. 
Um, but thank you. Thank you for this suggestion, Rachel. Uh, so I will pick a pop behind me. No one guessed yet. I'll pick a pop behind me, and you guys have to guess which one it is. Um, what What is going on here? How many? Was there anything else in our box? No, we're good. Okay, let me let me see who who is behind me. Can I scoot this back and like what? Oh god, who is behind me in here? I can't even. I don't even know. Okay, I don't know. Where is everyone? Okay. Um. Um, you guys are looking at my eyes right now, right? For which one I'm looking at. Okay. I got one. I got one, guys. Go ahead. Everyone guess which pop I'm looking at, and the winner will get uh, one of my hundreds of giveaway items over here. Uh, Funko Pops or anything I just unboxed or anything from my uh, past unboxing videos. Solid, is you single? Um, single what? What does that mean? Solid, is you single? I don't understand the question, Daniel Hart. Um, yes, the like I'm a single person. It's one of me. I'm not. I'm not like. Uh, what is that? Siamese twin. Tell me, is there a clone of me, or do I have a twin brother? I don't. Uh, Heathen Christensen, Captain Boomerang. Nope, nope, nope. Stitch, Spider Man, Deadshot. Oh, God, no. You guys are so quick. Remember, you only have three tries and then they silence you. Silence. They silence you. Well, silence you. That means you can't type anymore. Emmett Brown, Spider Man, Killing Joke Storm. Killing Joke Joker, Cheshire Cat, Anti Venom, Jack Skellington, LC Tracer, Avengers. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I can't. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope, nope. Man, you guys thought I was going to pick my favorite pop? Y'all are crazy. Why would I do that? If you, <laughs> Why would I pick Batman or any Dragon Ball? Or did I? Hmm. All right, guys, you got one minute. Let's go. One minute. Let's go. Um, make sure no one did say it. I don't think anyone said it. Do, 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 do. <laughs> God, you guys are so horrible at this. The moon guy with the hood? Who Who the hell is that? Who's the moon guy with the hood? Oh, uh, Jesus. Hobby on Predator, Katana, Deadshot, Squirrel, Catwoman, the Stitch, Killing Me, Maleficent, Katana, Agent 13, Cheshire. All right, Christopher, we throw got it. Jesus Christ. Morbius. It was Morbius, Dr. Morbius. Uh, where's he at? Right here. I knew like half of you didn't even know his name. That's why I chose him. Good job. Good job. Christopher, we throw, and one of my patrons, or patrons, so awesome. Christopher got it. Is that why you chose that game? Because you thought you could decipher me, huh, Chris? Dr. Strange. Yeah, so Christopher got it, guys. Congratulations to Chris. Morbius. Dr. Morbius was it. Um, awesome. So, yeah. You get to pick from my stash of things. That was fun. I might be doing another live stream tonight, guys. So, it'll be uh, like around 11, 12 o'clock uh, U.S. time. It's going to be like 12 o'clock or 12 or 1 o'clock uh, Japan time. I'm going to try to do it. I should. It'll probably happen. I do want to do another one. Um, but yeah, and maybe do another giveaway for it. I, I'm going to be doing quite a few giveaways because it's the holidays and I feel like I'm, I'm in a very giving mood. So yeah, I want to get you guys, uh, some winnings out there. 
some gifts. Uh, thanks for coming, everybody. I'm going to get started. I got to shoot these other videos, uh, edit them, and start my day off. It's it's 12.52 here. Probably going to go get some food and then, yeah, start my day off. Uh, thanks, everybody, for showing up. Cyberwolf, Daniel Harp, Christopher Weathrow, all my Patreons out there. Thank you guys for showing up. Parchment Books, um, Timberly, Rachel, Kyle, Trinidad, Laura, or Camilla, OG Tone Man, thank you, thank you for showing up, guys. This was this is really cool. I didn't I didn't expect uh, more than like two people to show up, so this was really cool that you guys showed up. Um, Yellow, he is <laughs> he is Harpatron. <laughs> you will have your shirt off tonight during the live stream. Um, sure, sure, Daniel Hart, I'll have my shirt off during the live stream. See you, solid. Thanks, bye. Have a good day. All right, guys. All right, guys. It was fun. You guys have a good day or enjoy your night if you're in America. Uh, enjoy your day if you're in the UK or in Japan. So, or anywhere in that hemisphere. All right, guys. Stay solid. Stop the broadcast. What am I?